Robert Downey Jr. is coming back to the MCU, which could present the perfect opportunity for an emotional deleted scene from Avengers, Endgame to finally be seen in live action. Downey Jr. was the face of the MCU from his debut in 2008's Iron Man till his departure in 2019's Avengers, Endgame, but the latter marked a huge transition for the armored Avenger. Endgame revealed Tony Stark to be a father, as Morgan Stark was during the MCU's five-year-long blip, but not all of her touching moments with her father were included in the Phase 3 movie. While Avengers, Endgame introduced Morgan Stark to the MCU, the movie also marked her final appearance. Tony Stark sacrificed himself to save the universe in Endgame, leaving Gwyneth Paltrow's pepper pots to take care of their daughter, but Iron Man's emotional departure was originally planned to be heightened by a scene shared with Morgan Stark in the Soul Realm. This tender moment was ultimately cut from Avengers, Endgame's theatrical release, but Marvel Studios could now reimagine this deleted scene in the MCU's future. Catherine Langford's Avengers, Endgame scene was cut from the final movie. Just as Thanos had shared a moment with a young Gamora in the Soul Realm after snapping his fingers in Avengers, Infinity War, Tony Stark was going to see the same treatment in Avengers, Endgame. After snapping his fingers with the Infinity Stones, a scene had been planned and filmed which saw Stark meeting his now teenage daughter in the Soul Realm. This older version of Morgan Stark was played by 13 Reasons Why and Knives Out star Catherine Langford, but her entire role was brutally cut from Avengers, Endgame prior to the movie's release. Directing duo the Russo brothers have since explained that this scene was cut to remove too many goodbyes for Tony Stark from Avengers, Endgame. Including this scene would have broken the movie's momentum, with a goodbye happening in the Soul Realm, another happening for Spider-Man and Pepper Potts, and another at Stark's funeral service. Catherine Langford revealed to Collider that she's fine with being cut from Avengers, Endgame, but now that Robert Downey Jr. is returning to the MCU, it's possible that she could, too. Robert Downey Jr.'s return means Catherine Langford's Morgan Stark can finally join the MCU. Robert Downey Jr. as Doctor Doom in AI MCU art. Marvel Studios boss Kevin Feige and the Russo brothers confirmed that Robert Downey Jr. will be returning to the MCU at this year's SDCC. However, he won't be coming back as Iron Man, but will instead be portraying iconic Marvel villain Doctor Doom. The sheer fact that Robert Downey Jr. is returning means the opportunity is there for Catherine Langford to follow suit, and there are many different forms that this could take in the MCU's Phase 6. Some theories suggest Downey Jr.'s Doctor Doom could be a variant of Tony Stark from another reality who becomes the powerful villain, which means Langford could return as this version's own daughter. This could also see Langford portray the alternate Valeria Von Doom from Marvel Comics, Doctor Doom and the Invisible Woman's Daughter from another universe. Of course, Langford could also return to the MCU as Earth 616's Morgan Stark, grown up in the years since Avengers, Endgame, and this would contribute to some incredibly emotional moments Morgan Stark in Avengers, Doomsday and Secret Wars could create a very emotional moment. Tony Stark with Morgan Stark in Avengers Endgame. Whichever version of Doctor Doom Robert Downey Jr. might be playing in Avengers, Doomsday and Avengers, Secret Wars, it's very possible that he could come face to face with Catherine Langford's Morgan Stark. This would give Langford a truly heartbreaking scene, as she would be forced to face off against a villain who looks exactly like her late father. Since the Russo brothers cut her last scene in Avengers, Endgame, they may be inclined to bring Catherine Langford back as Morgan Stark, but this would be a much more tragic reunion for her than meeting her father in the Soul Realm.